And this is why you do what you do, ladies and gentlemen. Got a juicer. Wherever I go, boom, Smart Tree case. What's up? Smart Tree, sponsor us. We'd love to have your cases. Nice find, the place to find something nice every time. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. It is Damien at Nice Find Wholesale here in our North Aurora warehouse. I know, I know, the setting's a little bit different, but it is season two. And today, we got something in store for you guys. Oh, you guys loved our mystery box video. If you haven't checked it out, go check it out. But yeah, we figured, why not give the people what they want, aka, more mystery boxes. So today, we have two truckloads coming out. KK's unloading one of them right now. And yeah, and they're mystery boxes, so we figured prop up a table, let's put up a camera, and let's shoot a nice YouTube video. Bring it over here. We're gonna crack it. We're gonna crack it for the YouTube channel. <laughs> I really hope that was on purpose, I swear to God. Was it? Oh. <laughs> You literally just got certified last week. I know I talk a lot of smack about OSHA. I apologize. We all have been trained on the forklift now. We went to the OSHA safety briefing. Obviously, some people didn't listen. <laughs> Where's your beep when you're backing up, man? OSHA. <laughs> But, all right, let's see what we got here. To be honest, I have no idea if these are FCs or LPNs. I know that's what we talked about a lot last video. No idea until you actually crack it open and get into them. So as you guys can kind of all see, these are all sealed. The pallet just arrived. We got some electronic stickers on there. These are my favorite. They don't mean much per se, but it's nice to get your hopes up, you know? <laughs> all they mean is a lot of people think they mean they're gonna have a huge electronic or a big score because of the battery stickers. That just means there's batteries in there. That could be anything. Could be a set of string lights with the little tiny batteries. It could be a keychain. It could be literally the smallest little gadget with the tiny batteries or double A's and, and they're, you know, and they gotta put that lithium sticker on it. But, all right, let's go. All right, this is not bad. Ah, da -da -da. I think we did both last time, right? We did FCs and LPNs, so hopefully this has some variety. And this one will be LPNs. Look at that, bam. You got the Govi string lights. Those are definitely some money on eBay. Some party supplies, clothes, shoes. This is definitely an LPN box. I can tell right now, just based off the stickers, LPN stands for license plate number, and that's what Amazon uses to track their returns in their warehouse. That just means it's coming from a return facility. Doesn't per se mean that the item has made it to the customer and back. Sometimes I like to crack a nice little mystery box. Mystery box inside a mystery box. Double whammy. See what we got here. Some sort of, oh, it's a fountain. It's a mini like a desktop fountain. I'm looking for the Apple product for the name brand stuff, for the electronics that we can flip on eBay or Amazon. The water bottle. Flowers, ooh, a helmet. No name brand though. Whenever you're looking for helmets, you wanna have them, uh, if you see the MIPS logo, that tends to mean that the helmet is actually a little bit more valuable because um, that MIPS is like a certification to like, for a certain like amount of pressure that the helmet can withstand. I, I'm literally just rambling right now. Those MIPS ones, that means that it's an actually legit helmet. It's probably worth some money. Some styling tools. Ooh, acrylic paint. That's spilled out. Yeah. So nothing too crazy. The piece count's there. I mean, if you're getting this box for 50 bucks, these Govies have paid it for itself back. I mean, I'm kind of, I would say this is the only thing that would be valuable enough to flip on eBay right off the top of my head. But obviously we're not, uh, we're not scanning everything. So it's kind of, uh, it's un kind of unfair. Uh, like 36, 37 bucks. Just depends which model. Yeah, 40 bucks on eBay. And then you get a bunch of pieces. Not too much name brand stuff in this one. So. <laughs> deal with a ton of these mystery boxes. I actually couldn't believe that first video went off as the way it did. That was crazy. Cause we do this stuff every day. Ooh, nice. This one, yeah, this, so this is looking like an, a, like a, an LPN palette of boxes. Look, Amazon returns. We got a little mystery box. These are my favorite, cause these are typically where you find like uh, some laptop without its chargers or an iPad, but today we find Tupperware. <laughs> some clothes. A yoga ball, colored shoelaces, clothes, metal tin, full of gold coins. <laughs> I have a feeling there's gonna be buttons. Oh, is that what it is? I was like, what is this? Nice. I've literally never baked cookies in my life. I would say tablecloth, queen size duvet cover. Uh, this is probably the biggest thing. 
Certified my ass. <laughs> a dehumidifier, not bad, not bad. This is probably an easy $25, $35 flip right there. Smart baby scale, nice. Ooh, and a power bank. So we got a, I would say these right here. This is gonna be your nicest finds. Ah, nice find. Uh -huh. Smart baby scale, this is definitely interesting. Oh, and it has a UPC code, UPC code. Let's see if we can scan it on eBay and see what happens. Are oh, you liking the eBay app? eBay stuck in the 1970s. We're gonna take down my accounts now. Smart baby scale, going for 55, 55 bucks. Smart baby scale, not bad, not bad. That's just one thing, Immuto power bank. You guys also gotta consider, I'm only checking eBay. This is like re resale value, I guess, more than anything. But if you're looking for like retail value, these are a lot higher, because obviously eBay, you gotta have cheaper, right? This one's going for 39 bucks, so 38.80, so not bad. Not a bad find. So we're already at $100 right here. And then this dehumidifier. Yeah, I figured this time around, let's instead of going through the whole box one by one, just pick out the ni nicest two, three items. We'll see what it gets us to, uh, not finding it. Let's just call it a nice 20 bucks. <laughs> These two items paid for the whole box regardless. So I would say this is a great box. You still got around 10, 15 items left over. So not bad. <laughs> yoga ball, forgot about the yoga ball. See, it all depends what you're doing with these boxes. If you're running a bin store, these are money. If you're running a flea market stand, money. If you are running garage sales, money. You can do a lot with these. I know I've seen some people do Mercari and Etsy with them, like one by one. UVD, LED, blacklight. Because these are, a lot of these things are just Chinese generic items. You just gotta find the right buyer. Like this is a brand new Mario sweater, like a hoodie by Nintendo. Sick. Official Nintendo pr license product. Not bad. Some sort of a blanket, tent maybe, something. Maybe. Don't know what that is. Oh, like a computer, like a laptop stand for your desk. Oh, yes, more Govi, nice. Water detector by Govi, not bad. I'm sweating, it's too hot. Why, why are warehouses not AC'd? I just don't understand. And Conrad said no fans because they make a noise for the camera, so. Good job, Conrad. Maji. <laughs> just get everybody sweaty on here. <laughs> oh, this is uh, a monitor stand. I mean, so this box looks like it has around 20-ish items. Maybe 25, there's a couple small things on the bottom here, like whole oximeter, some clothes, some more clothes. These two I would say are your best bet. Govi water detector and a UV LED black light. This is the only name brand stuff, so we're gonna move on. And keep it honest and nice fine. We'll show you everything that comes in through these loads. Cause not every load and not every pallet's gonna be a home run and not every box is gonna be a home run. And that's very important to keep in mind. All right, this one looks packed to be honest. Some sort of a wig, is a USB desk fan, technology for gas security. Oh, it's like a gas detector. Oh, got an American flag. No, swim trunks. They belong on me. America, baby, not bad. Not my size though. They are XL, but there's no way these are XLs. Thick boy strikes again. They aren't. Party supplies, premium falfa tape, rigid strapping tape. Folding shelf brackets, baby katan, baby carrier. These fly on Mercari and eBay. Like if you got, if you ever come across baby carriers, that's a great Mercari product. I don't know why it's super popular. I don't have a baby yet, so I can't tell you why. Woo, drone, nice. Drone, definitely a return because the box is super beat up, but let's see if it's all there. I love drones. Conrad likes drones too, right Conrad? That's right. What if it's just the case? Oh my God, it seems awfully light. <laughs> nice. Definitely used though, hundred percent. But remotes there. Wings are. Is that wings? Oh, somebody crashed it. Look, that's not gonna fly straight. There's no way. Oh, that's too bad. But see, these are the type of things you get. So sometimes you can score a drone, but it could be broken. Yeah, this thing is packed. This one's probably the most packed I've seen it. Table numbers, one to 30, head table, probably some wedding planning stuff. Bamboo mattress cover and protector. Here's the thing. This looks legit. What happened to my knife? The amount of knives I lose every single day, it's unreal. This one looks interesting. I like a nice packaging, right? This, this just screams 
aesthetics. <laughs> headphones, nice. Headphones, active noise canceling, not bad. These look pretty nice. This is a very nice box to be honest. And we still have another 15, 20 items to go, but these are some nice headphones. Dog leash, six inch shelf brackets, heavy little box. Mini, mini mystery box within the mystery box. Some sort of bracket or handles. I'm just looking for the drones and the headphones. Again, mystery box within the mystery box. Ooh, Jesus, look at that. This is literally <laughs> like uh, it's one, two, three, 20 flashlights, all different colors. So that's what I was saying. Like if you're a shopkeeper, a small business, and you have like maybe a gas station or a 7-Eleven or whatever, like these boxes can do some serious damage. 20 flashlights that are like this. Sometimes they got that little like strip battery included. Ooh, and two batteries included. What a deal. Yeah, so 20 flashlights within this mystery box, just in a little one, bam. Um, I mean, if you price these out at two, three, four bucks, I mean, like even at $2, you're at 40 bucks right there in sales. And if you price out at five, you just made some, some serious dough. And this box just keeps on giving. Dog training collar, this thing seems brand new, not even opened, that's cool. Humidifier, mini air cooler and humidifier. Too hot in Chicago land for that one right now. Uh, some sort of like sports bra or corset. Tablet cover for kids. These are kind of cool because they're like the, the rigid ones, the ones that the kids can just bang out against anything. Uh, rip some sort of like exercise strap. More clothes, another charger. Oh, a USB converter. Tablecloth or curtain. Some sort of straps, exercise. Oh, I know what these are. These sell on eBay as well. Flea and tick collars for pets. Uh, you can flip those for 10, 15, 20 bucks. Depends on the brand. And then some little stuff on the bottom here. Remote control cable. And then you got a vegetable chopper and you got a set of light bulbs. I think this box is the most valuable. Definitely the most pieces and I would say the most value. But yeah, this is kind of what it is, right guys? Like, you know, you can have a whole pallet of 20 and it can just be filled with absolute nonsense or it could be a total home run because we've had boxes where you open it and it's just like four or five, six projectors. It just happens one every four or 500 boxes, right? It's not gonna happen very often. That's why we're in this business. We love to gamble. Pretty nice box for sure. Look at all these things. Anyone and anything would make money on this. You just gotta kind of get creative but uh even with ebay like these dog collars with the teak collar the D dog training collar this mini humidifier the gas detector licensed by nintendo mario party hoodie and this broken drone you can always sell for parts like we're about to sell those pallets for parts <laughs> don't forget you can always sell things for parts guys i hear, hear a lot of people like oh we got broken this broken that what do we do blah 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 well you can always sell it for parts you'd be surprised what people buy for parts especially drones the little propellers the little arms landing gear all that stuff can be scrapped and reused so people do do that so keep that in mind okay we're just gonna move on all right I want to see the one with the, with the battery sticker. We already went through the batteries. See, we went through the battery ones and there was no batteries in there. Nothing crazy at least. No tablets. Mystery box time. One more. All right. Knives on the side so I don't lose them and let's run through it. Clothes. Birthday tiara. More clothes. Smart tree. Not sure what this is, but we're about to find out. Ooh, like a safe. This is pretty cool. I'm not sure what this is. Pelican case type thing. Yup. I don't think it's a gun case though, is it? It could be. Oh, it's for a drone. This is slick. Or for a camera. It's got the I'm gonna look so professional walking around with my vlogging gear. Wherever I go, boom. Smart tree case. What's up? Smart tree, sponsor us. <laughs> We'd love to have your cases. <laughs> no, this is a really nice case. But I would, yeah, this is, uh, you're saying a uh, drone case? Yeah, it's for uh, DJI. Oh, that's Matic, cool. Matic Dang. All right. So yeah, this is definitely a come up. This is really cool. Towel set, maybe bathroom rugs, bathroom rugs, clothes, clothes, couch cover. I see a video game, a Wii game, a Michael Jackson Wii game. Boom. Michael Jackson, baby. Some leather pillow covers. Uh, I would say tablecloth, uh, knee brace, bikini, sunglasses, hopefully Ray-Bans. No, no, no. They're going to be the China ones. Definitely women's. Sunglasses are nice too. I buy the $20 ones. Or if I find some Ray-Bans on a load, then I'm keeping them. <laughs> now we have, oh, pot, rot rotary tool. So that's nice, nice, definitely. For sure an eBay flip. 
brand new, all sealed, a rotary tool. Jewelry and metal and this is a nice find for sure. Yeah, I mean, wow, look at that. Two big, two nicest things are in uh, sick little cases. And then we got a mystery box within the mystery box because we love mystery boxes. Because YouTube loves mystery boxes. It's too early in the morning. It's been a long week, all right? And no one's talking to me right now. I'm, why am I the only one on the monologue you know right what? now? Conrad, you're supposed to be interacting. This is a monologue? <laughs> oh, uh, solar floodlight. You're doing a great Not job. bad. Thanks, man. I'm a little sweaty and I'm a little tired, but we'll persevere. We'll turn on the fan in just a second here. Please. <laughs> it's so hot. He's just floating his toilet paper off the side of the forklift. <laughs> Those are our pallet labels. We're trying to be organized. It's really hard to be organized in the warehouse. This size, with this many pallets coming in. Um, so we're just trying to label each pallet as we go and then uh, keep track of it because it, uh, it helps to make sense of the numbers at the end of the month and the year. We're pretty much selling anything and everything. So if you want to buy anything and everything, <laughs> nicefineholesale.com, shameless plug. And if you're not subscribed to this channel, please do. Uh, but yeah, no, so right now our main focus is going to be pallets and truckloads and supplying stores, resellers, warehouses, pallet houses, and any sort of businesses. That's what Nice Fine Wholesale is going to be all about. And bringing in more and more Amazon returns and Amazon pallets, Target, Walmart, Home Depot, Wayfair. Yeah, pretty much anything and everything that we can bring in. The main focus is going to be Amazon returns because that's kind of our bread and butter because we started in the bin store. We've, that's kind of our, where our expertise lies. Yeah, just going to be focusing on supplying people and supplying individuals and supplying businesses. And hopefully you guys like the stuff we supply. <laughs> Um, but yeah, let's keep running through this. This is a lot of stuff, right? So imagine like if you bring one of these pallets into your garage, you're gonna have a ton of ton and ton of things. I highly recommend getting organized ASAP, maybe some garage shelves, maybe some totes, maybe some sort of like a boxing system, some, in, some sort of inventory system for sure. And I would try to sort it as I go. Rule of thumb is touch it once, just touch it as least amount of times as possible, whatever you're doing. And it doesn't matter if it's, you're talking about a pallet or if you're talking about a box or if you're talking about a particular item, you want to touch it as least amount of times as possible. Obviously, for the sake of YouTube video, we're kind of going to touch it multiple times for the, for the funds. <laughs> but uh, if we were actually processing these, if we're actually trying to get them for, ready for sale, we would just kind of like sort it out, pull the stuff we want to pull for eBay and Amazon and, and e-commerce, and then the rest would go into the bin store. So, and then we're just touching it once instead of messing with it more than a couple times because it's a lot of stuff. Look at this pile of things. This is four boxes. I'm opening up a fifth one. And if this is like your garage, like w this is a one car space already just, just ruined right there and then. So um, yeah, definitely helps to keep organized. <laughs> ah, fucking allergies, man. I got terrible allergies. Damien allergies. That's just what it is. But, all right, enough whining for the day, all right? Soaker hose, 10 footer, bam, found in the mystery box. Clothes, clothes, random bag, bath mat, pillowcases, snowboarding goggles, pretty sick. Looks like some uh, women's snowboarding goggles. Those always go and do well on eBay. LED nightlight, a little cute little nightlight. Maybe I'll put this one on the side for KK. He gets scared and lonely sometimes at night. Another set of goggles. <laughs> I wonder if he hears it when I'm uh, just saying. Another set of goggles, clothes, bikini, ice cream scooper. I love ice cream, just throwing that out there. If somebody wants to send me a pint in the mail, you know, dry ice it and freeze it, and that'd be much appreciated. <laughs> this is a mystery box within a mystery box. It's a metal mug, pretty cute. This is a nice pink box. Nice, dessert cups. Magnet bamboo knife block. That is very nice, actually. Hard shell laptop sleeve case or doesn't say, but Smart Tree. Smart Tree was this. Uh huh. Look at that. This must be a big Amazon brand. If it's a Smart Tree, then uh, oh, another set of Govies. But these are actually Smart Thermal. Oh, so Govi just makes a bunch of stuff, huh? Clothes, clothes, sort of decorations, bikini, clothes, and that's it. I would rank this one six out of 10 maybe. Uh, the goggles definitely make it. I think that's the nicest. Uh, it depends what you're looking for, of course. But if you're looking for eBay stuff, goggles, bamboo knife block for sure. And then I would definitely run through some of these bikinis and different bags. I mean, so just right there and then you paid for the box alone. 
and eBay. And then the rest of the stuff is free. And then, wait, let's open this pink thing because this thing looks, oh no, this is dessertware. Oh yeah, this, it's plastic. Could be worth reselling, not sure. Um, but I don't know, it's just like when it's open like that and it's kind of looking a little musty, <laughs> it's uh, probably not the best thing to sell on eBay. But, all right, let's push that. That one worked out. Pretty nice. You know what we did do differently last time? Oh, and this is why you do what you do, ladies and gentlemen. Got a juicer, and it's big. Nice. Hell yeah. That's money. But see, that was, so we have to go through eight boxes to get a juicer. That's still pretty good on. Hell yeah, nice, $137. Bam, the same one, Orfield. Not bad, not bad. Some of these mystery boxes are definitely a better surprise than others. Socks, uh, some sort of like a bag. Ladybugs breast milk collector. These actually sell pretty well on, uh, on eBay as well. A uh, rubber toy for a dog. Clothes. Portable LED work light. That's not bad at all. Nice. This thing looks pretty sick, actually. Oh, yeah. This thing's legit. It's metal. It's nice. It's nice. <laughs> I love Borat. Borat. <laughs> Extra deep quilted mattress pad. Mattress pad, actually, not just a pillow. A clothes, clothes. A USB-C to USB OTG adapter. Uh, more clothes. Um, yeah, I mean, that juicer obviously made that box. That's a $137 juicer, plus you get all this stuff. I mean, the mattress stopper and the work light can easily be resold, and then all the other stuff as well. It's just, I'm not sure how well it would run on eBay. But uh, this stuff, this is a great box. And that juicer, bam, that's one sale and you get your money back plus some. And all this stuff then becomes free. So not bad at all. We're already at eight, right? We're right there. Dang, we're already at eight, so might as well. Dang, this pile is just gonna, I'm just creating a bigger mess. You are uh, manifest, you wanted to open up some boxes and now you got some boxes. I'm gonna skim through this one, all right? Let's see what this is. Oh, nice. Uh, low power Wi-Fi video doorbell. Sick. A cup holder table uh, phone mount. Perb AC adapter. Uh, arts and crafts, Christmas wreath, snowflake projector light, sleeping bag. Either a sleeping bag or some sort of a tarp. Got two random mystery boxes within the mystery boxes, so naturally we're gonna have to crack them. You're ch checking, uh, checking in on KK to see if he's not gonna run me over, right? Yeah, he's <laughs> Supposedly he got certified last week. They gave him all these little ID cards, but um, I don't know, I don't know. Arts and crafts, bikini, bikini, jewelry box, mini one. Another AC adapter. These are actually pretty good to sell on eBay as well. It depends what the brand is, but oh, nice. Battery powered wireless Wi-Fi outdoor camera. So we got two cameras in here and that one's brand new. A bikini, another bikini, and uh, this looks like some sort of a computer part. Oh, it's a diamonds tester. Ha, ah, we should test my grill later. Not a bad box. You got a sleeping bag, two Wi-Fi cameras, pretty good. And then a bunch of other goodies. So not bad. So that's number nine. So number 10. It's just right around the corner. Bam, bada bam, bada bam. All right, number 10, here we go. Does that mean the, uh, the third mystery box video we're gonna have to do 15 or 25? Keep on scaling. Oh my God. Oh, nice. Wi-Fi extender, definitely. These are like the best type of electronics, right? Like these and the Wi-Fi cameras, like they're small, they're compact. They ship for cheap and you can, like everybody kind of wants these type of things like a Wi-Fi extender, doorbell, right? Uh, camera, security camera. And these are usually things that you don't have to have a super well-known brand in order for them to do their job. So um, definitely cool things. Uh, some sort of a shirt, a blouse, kids t-shirt, bikini, some sort of maybe like a towel or a rug, garbage bags, little um, decorative flowers, pillowcases, more pillowcases, Christmas tree lights, a cage for a water bottle, arts and craft boxes. Oh, nice. Oh, 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 don't open. AeroPress, the better coffee press. Pretty sure this one was on Shark Tank, wasn't it? Possibly. Dude, I'm like 90% sure, I wonder. This is cool, let's uh, look at the value of that one. A journal, a mist sprayer, duvet cover, a cable raceway, so if you're installing some cable, this is pretty nice. Oh, and a My Little Pony toy. 
<laughs> Flying horse. That one's definitely good with a cake. Here. <laughs> and that's pretty much it. Oh, there's this thing. What's this? Some jewelry. Cool. I would say these things are the most exciting right here. Per usual, they're the most colorful things too. But I am curious about this AeroPress. 40 bucks on Amazon. That's not bad at all. 40 bucks on Amazon. I just Googled it. it if it was on Shark Tank, which I've definitely seen it somewhere. Maybe it was just uh, on my uh, like Facebook feed. Or maybe somebody had it. Okay, are you ready for another Amazon truck? Ha! I knew it! I knew it. It is. It was on Shark Tank. Nice. Yeah, AeroPress. Sick. Huh. I love Shark Tank. It's so fun. But yeah, this is pretty cool. If that's 40 bucks on Amazon, we can probably get it 30 bucks for, for it on eBay. Um, a Wi-Fi extender and a cable thing and some toys. So not a bad box at all, but that's 10 boxes. So not a bad day haul, huh? We still have 10 more, but not going to do them. I'm sweating too hard. And we got actually work to do. That's it, folks. That's 10 boxes, like promised. This is video number two, I guess, on mystery boxes. But you guys loved it. And I kind of like it, too. This was fun. This was 10 boxes, LPN, Amazon return boxes. So these are coming from return centers. And you can tell the items are a little bit more beat up than you would uh, see on an FC load. They're a little bit more played with, damaged, right? Um, a lot of these things can be either in... Uh, miss ships as well or just box damages on the shelf, right? They were trying to fulfill it and they dropped it ran it over a little bit uh, Cracked it and it's going into the return column, but 10 cool boxes I'd say solar lights a juicer doorbell rings and a bunch of uh, Wi-Fi cameras an AeroPress shark tank product. That's cool toys tons and tons of clothes jewelry I think one or two dehumidifiers humidifiers a couple pairs of sunglasses Christmas decor, uh, dessert wear, dog toys and pet food, a sleeping bag, bunch of water bottles, couple drone cases and laptop cases, a rotary tool, bikinis, water bottle cages for bike, garbage bags. Yeah, we've seen it all today, guys. <laughs> but that's exactly what this type of palette and this is exactly what this type of box is all about. It's gonna be a random and huge assortment of product that is being sold on Amazon. And you can either get super lucky and land a juicer for 140 bucks in a $50 box, or you can get super miss lucky and get a bunch of face masks and hand sanitizers in a box we haven't hit one of those today but they do happen and i promise you they're not as fun as they sound <laughs> but when you hit a home run like this it makes it all worth it and it's fun and the fun keeps coming right if you're a gambler i think these kind of mystery boxes are for you as always guys comment like and subscribe and please do us a favor share this on your social media it doesn't cost you anything but we're a small local business and we could use your support thank you guys thank you all so much for watching see you next week